Turning tragedy into triumph is what motivates one local woman after her sister was kidnapped and killed by a boyfriend. This local woman's name is Katrina Carmichael, and she has since dedicated her life to help fight back against domestic violence. Her story is so inspiring that we had a surprise her and help grant a wish. We're in Romulus this morning for Inspire Today, and I'm joined by Sonia because you nominated your friend Katrina. Why did you nominate Katrina? Well, I nominated Katrina because she's such an inspiration to so many people. Getting to know her, I found out that she lost her sister due to domestic violence. And so she challenged that pain into something positive. She wanted to help people who are going through the same thing. How has it been for her? I know her sister passed away about 10 years ago, but how has it been for her? Her sister was her best friend. It's been it's been a hard road for her, but she, she always says that, she, you know, her sister's looking down on her. So she is a teacher. She's out of school officially. Yes. So she's home for the summer. She has no idea that we're coming over. No idea whatsoever. And she doesn't even know you're coming over. No, she doesn't. She doesn't like surprises. <laughs> she always wants to have her hair on point. I might lose a friend today. I don't know. <laughs> and then hopefully gain one back when she finds out why we're here. Yes. Okay. How are you? Um, I heard about you on my chest. <laughs> right, I'm at Broadcast Me from Local 4 News. We're here to inspire today. Your friend Sonia wrote a very nice letter about you. We want to let her read it. Is that okay? <laughs> yes, please. Okay. I am nominating Katrina Carmichael. She is a mentor, educator, author, and a sister of domestic abuse victim. For several years ago, her sister was kidnapped and murdered by her estranged boyfriend, leaving two children without a mother nor a father because he's in jail for the rest of his life. Katrina started a nonprofit called Sada's House, which stands for Sisters Against Domestic Abuse. Katrina is an amazing, powerful, and strong woman that deserves this honor. Oh, goodness, Sonia, thank you so much. You're so welcome, you deserve it. And I want to help other little girls. You know, I already took the test for you guys. I want to help you so you don't have to go through what my sister went through. Right. Well, as I mentioned, we're here to inspire today, and part of that, we wanted to grant a wish for you. So the Salvation Army of Metro Detroit wants to help you as well. They want to be able to provide a shelter for any of the domestic violence abuse victims that contact you to be able to put them up in a place so they have a safe place to go right away. And Can Strong also heard your story. They are a farm to table food prep service. They want to join in with you on that and be able to provide food for the domestic violence abuse victims as well. Ooh, yes. So that's all taken care of. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm sweating. I'm too excited. <laughs> I don't know what to do it myself. Hairston Salon and Rodney Howell, the owner, they heard your story as well. And they want to do something for you. They want to give you a complete hair and makeup makeover. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm and just let me let you know, Rodney at Hairston Salon is one of the best. Okay? Two snaps. <laughs> you know what to do. Thank you so much. What do you miss the most about her? Her laugh. She laughed. She had a real big laugh all the time. That's a soft spot for me, and that's the reason why I do what I do. I know that I can help somebody because I'm helping myself at the same time. Mm -hmm. You're helping a lot of people. Yeah. We appreciate you. Thank you. Oh, All so in honor of her sister. Yeah. It was so nice to see her so happy yeah. and, you know, <laughs> just so excited and all yeah. of the different folks that helped to make it a special day for her. Absolutely. A big thanks to Can Strong, the Salvation Army, and Hershen Salon for helping us to grant that wish. But more importantly, domestic violence is real. And if you know someone or if you yourself are a victim of domestic violence, there is help out there. We've posted a link to Sada's house on the Local 4 Facebook page. There you can also nominate someone for Inspire Today. And you never know, we might show up and surprise you. <laughs>